Let's be real with each other, okay? Getting book reviews can be so painful. It's more fun getting a cavity filled or doing burpees than it is to ask people over and over and over again to write a review for your book. It's so important. So today I have seven ideas to help you get more book reviews with minimal begging. Stick around. Hi, I'm Julie the Book Broad, founder of this fabulous company called Book Launchers. We're a full service professional book publishing team that will help you write, publish, and sell a nonfiction book to grow your business and your brand. Let's dive right into this one, shall we? You need book reviews, period. Book reviews are social proof that your book is worth the money and more importantly, the time someone has to invest into reading it. And it's harder than ever to get book reviews on your book now. You'll ask 25 people, maybe 10 will say yes, and one of them will actually do it. So know this going into it, that you're going to have to be patient, persistent, and petulant. But I want book reviews. Won't you give me a book review? Oh. <sighs> Okay, maybe not petulant. I just wanted an alliteration and I couldn't come up with a third P. So patient, persistent, and popular. How about that one? <laughs> On top of that strategy, here are nine. <laughs> the seven ideas to get more book reviews for your book. Number one, ask for book reviews in your marketing collateral. Example, bookmarks, postcards, or other branded promotional giveaways. Our client, Robert Workman, has an excellent book for all sales professionals coming out soon called Hired Gun 2. And he's creating fun swag like this mug. When he sends these out, he should have a little biz card inside asking them for a review of his book or marketing the book if they haven't already bought the book or doing periodic draws from people who do reviews and send these out as thank yous. That's <laughs> pretty crazy. <laughs> Number two, build a book army who are willing to review in return for advanced review copies. That way, at least you'll know you'll have some reviews in the pipeline. Number three, Amazon isn't the only place to review books. So let people know to review you in different places because not everybody uses Amazon. So let them know that you also would love reviews on Goodreads, BookBub, any sites where people buy their books from, Barnes & Noble, Chapters Indigo, Kobo, iBooks. These sites all have places where reviews can be left. And by the way, somebody can take the same review from Amazon and copy and paste it everywhere. Never hurts to ask. Number four, remind folks. Drop hints and mix it with outright asking. Every once in a while, you can post something like this on social media. The best gift you can give an author is a review. Number five, link to the content where you want the review. Make it as easy as possible for people to leave reviews. So include links on your website to the pages where you'd like them to leave those reviews. Video reviews and longer reviews are preferred, but remind them that a review can be short and sweet, like a great book for X people is enough. And encourage early readers to write their reviews even if they haven't finished reading the book yet. They can always update that review when they're done reading. Number six, share your reviews in public. Check out this video I did on dealing with one star reviews. I talk about celebrating those good reviews in that video. Number seven, put your book on NetGalley. This is for people who are okay putting in some cash, but I've noticed that authors who do this tend to get a handful of reviews from NetGalley directly. You can tell because NetGalley reviewers have to post that they got a copy via NetGalley for a review. So when you're reading Amazon reviews in your spare time and you notice that, that's how you can tell. You do read Amazon reviews in your spare time, don't you? <laughs> it's not just me, right? <laughs> Maybe I should change my name to Julie the Book Nerd Broad. <laughs> All right, what do you do to get more book reviews? Share in the comments below after you hit that thumbs up button. And when you comment the day a video is released, you'll be entered to win some sweet book launcher swag like this mug. Hashtag no boring books. And of course, subscribe to the channel and turn those notifications on so you know when a new video is released. Now, head on over and watch this video on how to handle that one star reviewer because it's going to happen. Or just check out this fabulous video. Go ahead, click it or click this one. I'm waiting for you. Come on. <laughs> Give me book review, please.